Hello, everyone. This is Gigi with DPI Showcase Websites and CRM. And today I want to discuss all the automations that are, are included and are already happening in your CRM. So as you know, if you're a DPI client already, all of our websites come with a CRM attached to it. It's fully functioning, has all the features that all the other CRMs have. And I wanted to go over the automations that we've included in there. So this is our CRM. This is my personal CRM for my website. And the whole idea with our automations is that we got the most popular automations that most of our clients use. And we've decided to set them up in a way where they will fire off without you having to do anything. You don't have to sit in front of your computer and learn the APIs. You don't have to learn Canva. You don't have to learn drip campaigns or 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 um, coding, everything is done for you. The only focus you have is just making sure that the client is entered into your CRM and everything else happens for you. So I wanted to discuss those automations. Keep in mind that it's January, 2024. And if you watch this a year from now, we might have more because we're always trying to add automations. But for now, we're just gonna discuss what we have live today. Now, the first one is the birthdays. So all you have to do is worry about enter the client's birthday. So if you go, let's go into myself here. I'm here as a pretend customer in my own CRM so I can experiment with things. If you set my birthday, don't worry about the year. The system isn't tracking their age. Just focus on month and day. And everything is done for you as soon as you set that. The graphic, the drip, the campaign, and your client will be hearing from you every year on their birthday. So that's the first one, the birthdays. The second one is their holiday emails. If you go to tools and you go to holiday email templates, this is already happening for you. By default, these are all turned on. You can turn them off if you want to. You can turn individuals off if you want to. If you want to get your hands dirty, you can manage, you can edit the graphic, but just know it's all done for you. Everything is already, and my recommendation is to leave it as is. That way you can just focus on other things, but your clients will be hearing from you on all of these holidays as well. And you can see the date that they're going to go out to. So that's the second automation, the holiday email templates. The third automation, which is probably my personal favorite, is the newsletter. So let me uh, pop that over here and show you. So we're sending out a newsletter on your behalf to every client in your database with an email. The newsletter is a weekly newsletter. It goes out on Monday mornings, and this is what it looks like. Now, keep in mind, everything from your site is branded to you. So this would be your information. This would be your photo. And what it includes are the real estate related articles that we wrote for you from the previous week. Remember that part of your DPI service is that we're writing content for you every day on your blog page. This helps with SEO, keywords, just staying relevant overall. So we repurpose this and we pack it into a newsletter that goes out on Mondays to your entire database. And it's not just that, there is a call to action that goes to your free home evaluation page. There is more information on your brokerage and your social media icons. So someone can just click here and follow you on any of these platforms if they want to. So this is great because this is, takes a lot of time to do on your own whether you use other companies that specialize in email blasts, it takes a while. And so DPI does that for you. All you have to do is make sure that client is entered into your CRM with a valid email. That's it. So we did, we discussed birthdays, holiday emails, weekly newsletter. The fourth automation are the listing alerts. We call them save searches. So if you set up a listing alert for a client. They're going to be hearing from you anytime there's a new listing within the criteria you had set for them. This is what the, let me show you here. This is what a listing alert looks like. So keep in mind, branded to you with your photo and a direct link to that listing. And the great news is if, if they click here, it takes them straight to the listing on your website. There's no registration because a third party is sending it like some MLSs have. There's no three, four pages they gotta get through to see the listing. It's a direct link straight to the listing page on your website. So it makes it really user-friendly compared to other listing alert platforms. So if 
you need assistance on how to create a saved search, I'm going to post a link in the description of our video showing you how to create a saved search. I'm going to walk you through it in 10 seconds, but if you need more details, click that link below on creating a saved search. So let's go into myself. I have four saved searches. So I have four listing alerts set up for myself. You're going to click on the little blue person icon. You're going to scroll down to the section that says save searches, and you're going to follow these steps, starting with turning on this toggle, followed by clicking the add save search button. From there, you're going to create the listing alert for the client and you're going to be set to go. And that's something you do one time and that's it. They're hearing from you anytime there's a new listing inside that criteria. So let's go back to the client center. So we discuss birthdays, holiday emails, weekly newsletter, listing alerts. The last two automations are social media related. And let me just show you here. If you go to tools and you go to social auto postings, you're going to see that we can auto post to Facebook business page and LinkedIn. Now, what does it auto post? It posts two things. It posts the blog that we're writing for you every day, and it'll post a listing. Now you can set the criteria for that listing. I'm going to post another video in the description that goes into detail on this, on how to set this up correctly. It's pretty self-explanatory, but if you need a little bit of uh, more help, just check out that video in the description and uh, it'll walk you through this step by step. But what does this look like? So the auto uh, posting feature does two things. It'll post the daily real estate article every day and it'll post a random listing within the criteria you set here. So it'll post two things every day, an article and a listing. Let me show you what that looks like on Facebook. So this is our Facebook business page, okay? And you'll see that it'll post a listing and it'll post the real estate related article, listing, article, listing, article. And this is every day. If this is something you want, connect your Facebook business page and connect your LinkedIn. LinkedIn is the same format. It looks exactly the same. So I highly recommend that um, because it's something you just connect one time and your DPI service, your CRM and your website are providing content to your social media platforms, these two for now, without you really having to worry about it. So this is a great feature. So those are the automations for now. I hope this you found this video uh, informative. So just to recap, we have birthdays holidays, weekly newsletter, listing alerts, Facebook business page auto posting, LinkedIn profile auto posting. Hope this helps. Have a good day.